All right, hey everybody, Barry here with the Push Press Customer Success Team. Today we're gonna to walk through how we can edit our schedule to limit the number of reservations that are allowed in a class. Um, and then also kind of walk through what the member experience would be um, when we institute that wait list uh, with reservations. So the first thing we wanna do is log into our dashboard. And from there, we're going to go to our schedule and we need to edit our classes. So I'm just gonna click on this noon class and we can see here currently my class cap is set at 10. I actually wanna hit this edit button up top here so I can make a change to all of the occurrences of this class. So now I am going to scroll down and a couple things to note here are registration starts immediately. This is how far in advance do you want people to reserve for a class. Um, so in this scenario, maybe we're going to limit it that they can only res reserve a spot three days in advance and then registration end time. How close to the start of class do we want somebody to be able to reserve? I'm going to leave this one at the start time and then I'm going to change my class cap to four. And as I continue to scroll, I'm going to choose edit this in all future classes. And so we've got that edited. Now, if I go through and look and say we click on this Friday noon class, we'll see my attendance cap is four now. Okay, so now what we wanna look at is, I'm gonna hit view on this, and we can see this noon class has three reservations and one checked in. So based off from those parameters that we've just set up, this class is full. So now what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna switch over to the, members app and allow you to see what this is going to look like from the member side of things, how they're going to view this sign up. All right, cool. So now I'm in the members app inside of this members app. I'm going to come through hit here. I'm going to go to the class schedule. And we'll see this noon class here. Um, it says it's available, but it is in yellow. That's the wait list. Uh, the 7 p.m. class that's available, their spots. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna click on this noon class and I'm gonna choose join wait list. Now what the members are given is this option that how much time do they need or notice do they need to get to class um, if a spot opens up for them. So maybe they, maybe they live 30 minutes away from the gym, so they need at least 30 minutes prior to the start of class. So I'm gonna click on it, I'm gonna change this to 30 minutes. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and hit add to wait list. And now I'm first on the wait list, uh, look for a notification before 11.30 a.m. April 22nd, if a reservation pops up. Cool. So while we're there, I am going to go back in and I'm gonna quick remove one of these reservations. So now we can see what's gonna happen. So that's removed and you notice on my phone, I've got a new text message. Awesome, you're in, someone just canceled. Uh, flex and tone, sweat and tone on April 22nd at 12 p.m., no confirmation needed. I am in that class. If I go back to the members app and look, now that's, position is set at reserved. So that is a quick kind of overview of how the members app experience for waitlist works and then also how you can get your classes set up to be able to have those limitations. Um, and if you need to, you know, some classes uh, may have more attendance than others. You just edit those uh, individually for those days. Uh, as always, if you have more questions on any of this, feel free to reach out to the success team via intercom and we'll be there to answer your questions. Have a great day.